Peter Hudnut on his expedition called Nuticus on his way up. Nuticus Rexius. Let's watch his adventure as he climbs. Tell me if I'm about to step on an animal. See how high you can get up in this tree as we ascend to the very, very top of the Oh, there's a huge lizard. Big banyan tree on the way up. He's climbing up a branch that's going to probably snap. Keep going. I'm coming around the other side. Okay, behind the scenes. Is it orange? Yeah, so we got a bunch of new gear from one of the sponsors. Woo! Cool red pants. Try on the white ones. <laughs> Khaki and uh, off white. How's that look? Good. Do a tone. No, the, the board shorts are a lot better. Look at see, he's got some other fit. That's fit. The board shorts actually fit. Yeah. It's a 34, so also thank you very much. I'm just no. working out. Yeah. Swimming 20 miles. Of, uh, he's just been trying to make zip line weight. Yeah, he's been breaking that. <laughs> Behind the scenes. Peter, zip line through the jungle, Antigua. So we're here zip lining in the rainforest of Antigua. So far, I think we've done three zip lines, relatively short. Uh, Janai was doing some crazy stuff. Peter tried to fall off the last one. And now we're heading to, I think, the big one. This is going to be the big adventure of the day. So let's go see what it is. Is that good enough? You look great. Your little get up, like your, sand, yeah. your sandals and your glove, your little ass. restraints there you got there. Package. I think it's a good look. You get to wear these all the time. I'm chafing a little bit. <laughs> Here comes Peter through the jungle. You guys have no concept of giving a minute to get ready. I got the break at the end. You're supposed to give me a minute, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so when you're ready to do Even in Tiga, in Tiga, in Tiga.
Mike, did you have a fun time? Yes. This has become my travel tank top, since it's so nice and cool. It's the item I have with me. The weather's absolutely amazing. It's funny, going back to California, I've already been spoiled in Antigua. So, I thought I was in paradise, and it comes to a real, real piece of paradise. The Caribbean. It's Caribbean living, as you might call it. I'm quite used to this lifestyle. It's a good life.